hello guys welcome to my channel so whenever you try to install any ea titles from xbox app so this is just an example so any ea games when you try to install it from xbox app when you click on install if you see this error the error code is 0xa3ea0066 or if you are receiving this error code that is 0xa3e80004 so if you are receiving one of these error messages then please follow the steps shown in this video now the first step is to cancel the download and try it multiple times now this has worked for me sometimes so you can try it so open xbox app now whichever game is failing to install click on this x over here to cancel the installation so click on it then click on yes and then go back and then try to install the game once again sometimes it works in my case it's not working right now so again i'm receiving the same error so but you can try it multiple times so cancel the installation and then try to install it again but still you are receiving the error message in that case close xbox app so click on this up arrow make a right click and then click on quit close xbox app and then open xbox app once again again go to ea, EA play and then try to install the game which you want again i am receiving the error message again cancel the download click on yes and then try it once again sometimes it works so in my case it's not working but you can try it if it's not working then move on to the next step now the next step is to restart your computer so sometimes a simple restart takes care of the problem so restart your computer then open xbox app and then try to install the game now still you are receiving the error message in that case close origin now if origin is open over here close origin so make sure that you exit from here click on this up arrow and then make a right click then click on quit origin now once origin is closed now you can install the game once again so over here you can see it's preparing and it's installing now so if origin is open close it and then try to install the game so over here you can see the ea app launched successfully and i I'm getting this download option so you can click on download and the download should start and you should not receive the error message again but still you are unable to install in that case uh, end e app or origin services in task manager so make a right click on the start menu and then click on task manager now if e app is running in the background so find e services so here you can see e background service so any e app service it may be e background service or e app or anything related to e just make a right click and then click on end task now similarly find origin services so if you find origin services so i don't have any origin services running over here so if you find anything related to origin you can make a right click and then end task and if you find anything related to e app make a right click in the task manager and then close it now try to install install it once again now still after closing e app or origin services in task manager still you are unable to install in that case restart your computer once after the system restart try to open xbox app and then install it now still you are facing the error message in that case clear ea app cache now for this type in ea app in windows search box make a right click on ea app or simply type in ea over here make a right click on ea app and then click on open file location now over here you will see ea app recovery so make a right click on ea app recovery and then click on run as administrator click on yes to allow and now once done now close this over here you will see clear cache option click on it click on it and once done close this now open xbox app over here uh, it's opening e app so let it open first
Now enter your email and password over here. Now click on sign in. Now once EA app is up and running, you can click on install and let's check. So it's opening EA app once again. Even if the EA app is open, still it might restart EA app once again. So in my case, it was open, but still it's restarting. And then I am seeing the download option. So here you can see next. So you can install it from here. So I'm canceling it. So clear EA cache, uh, app cache by running EA app recovery as an administrator. It will uh, open EA app, then log in, and then again click on install, and then it will restart EA app, and you should get the download option. Now, still for some reason you are unable to install it, you are still receiving the error message, or still it's not installing. Then repair and reset Xbox app. So type in Xbox app in Windows search box, make a right click on Xbox app, then click on app settings. It will open Windows settings and scroll down here. You can see the repair option. Click on repair and after the repair, open Xbox app and then try to install the game. Still you are receiving the error code, then click on reset, reset. Now after the reset, open Xbox app and then try to install the EA game. Now still you are receiving the error message. The last step is to this is not the last, this is seventh step the, to uninstall EA app using Revo uninstall. So actually EA app is causing the problem. So you have to uninstall the EA app using the Revo uninstaller. So copy this link. The link is provided in the video description. Open this link in a browser. It will take you to this website and you have to download the free version of uh, here. You can see free download, free trial. So click on free download or free trial. It will not cost you anything. And here you can see keep and then run this exe file and install Revo uninstaller. So in my case, I think, no, it's not installed. Okay. So click on this exe file. Now click on yes to allow. Now click on OK, accept next, 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 install. Now after the installation, it will launch Revo uninstaller. Now find E app in the list. So let it load first. Over here you can see E app. Now select it, make a right click, then click on uninstall, or you can select it on the top here. You can see the uninstall option. Click on uninstall, click on continue. It will first of all create a restore point and then let the process complete. Now here you can see, okay, first of all, close E app. In my case, the E app was open. That's why it was not uninstalling it. Let me retry once again. So you will see the uninstall option. Click on uninstall. Now over here you can see uninstalling the app. Now once done, close this. Now do not close this over here. You have to click on scan. This is important. This is important part because it will remove all the leftover of E app. So now click on select all. So here you can see all the entry for the E app in the registry. So we have to select all and then click on delete. Yes. Now again, select all delete. Yes. Now close this. Now it is important to restart your computer now. Make sure that you restart your computer after this. Now, after the system restart, open Xbox app. Now, again, go to EA Games and then select your game. This is just an example. You select your game and then click on install. Now, it will give you an option to install EA app. So, click on, click on install EA app. Click on let's go, click on yes to allow. Now let the download complete. I'm sorry for the background noise. I have a tractor running over here. 
so please ignore the sound now after the installation it will launch the ea app now for some reason after the installation still ea app is not launching in that case click on install once again or you can click on see in the ea app now for some reason if it's still not opening then make a right click on the start menu and then click on task manager and in the task manager again find ea services so if you find ea services make a right click then click on end task so find ea or origin services and then end the task and then click on install once again now if it is stuck on preparing or if it's not opening in that case you can go to this and then cancel this and then again go back and then click on install or see in the ea app now it's not opening in that case close xbox app so close xbox app and then open xbox app once again now once you open ea app once again now click on see games and then select your game so select your game and then click on install once again or you can click on see in ea app and it should launch ea app So over here you can see the EA app is opening now. I'm sorry for the background noise again. So here you can see uh, I see the download option. Click on next. You can select your drive if you want and then click on download. And let's check. So over here you can see the download has started. Now still you are unable to install in that case uninstall and reinstall Xbox app. So type in Xbox app in Windows search box and make a right click on Xbox app then click on uninstall, uninstall. Now after the uninstall restart you can be there. Make sure that you restart you can be there after this. And after the system restart open Xbox app go to EA games and then install your game. Click on install. Now you should be able to see the download option click on next you can change the drive if you want and then click on download and it should start downloading so over here you can see it's uh, downloading now so one of the steps should help you to download ea games from xbox app and you should not receive the error codes again so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel